Greg and James, beat him up. That's right. It's the show where this guy... Greg, wow, okay. Haha, keep me on your toes. Yeah. And myself, James, play beat em ups That's the gimmick. That's how we that came up the with the name. How are you today, Greg? I'm good, yeah. Uh, been a busy week and geared up for... Uh... A new peak in students, which I'm sure you're getting geared up for too. Yes, the students in my line of work peak heavily during the school year. Yes. Well, it's it's starting early. The uh, Dalcott office opened and uh, just been inundated at work. But I'm excited to play some beat 'em up games. All right, and today we're leaving Double Dragon behind for now. We'll pick back up, because obviously Double Dragon does not come to an end after Double Dragon 3. Mm -hmm. But, to stay situated in these early years, we want to take a look at some of the other things. And so we're going back to the series that started them all. Because here's our first pure beat-em-up. Mm -hmm. Niketsu Renegade Kuniokan, or Niketsu Kua Kuniokan. And now, we're going to dive into the game... Uh, famously localized here is River City Ransom. Mm -hmm. Downtown Niketsu story! But to get there, let's a brief detour into non beat em ups here. Yeah. Because in between. Alright, one sec. I'm gonna try one more time to get our projector working right so we have a better view here. Hey, hey! There it goes! It worked! There, what did I do to fix it? I no. did nothing. It just fixed. Uh -huh. We're gonna use the quality up mode here. And I think we'll 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 leave the quality up on. I thought they did a pretty good job in this collection, uh, but okay. So when they went to originally make a sequel to Renegade or to Dekatsuko Kunio Ken, mm -hmm. uh, they wound up you know it developed away to such an extent that the guy wanted to make a different series, and this is how Double Dragon was born. When Techno's Japan Core returned to the character of Kunio Ken. It was for a dodgeball game. Now, this was originally released in the arcades, but just for the ease of setup... Yeah, we're gonna play the... Uh... We're just gonna do the NES port, so that I don't have to configure anything but my Switch here. So, have you ever played this game, Greg? I have not. Okay. Let's... I guess we gotta do versus play. We yeah. Take each other on. We gotta. Alright. Okay. So, select a character. England. India. Alright, uh, we'll play international. Yeah. And so, if you look at the sprites at the bottom, you'll notice that, uh, well, have you played any Kunio games on the NES? Yes, I have played River City Ransom. Okay, so these sprites, you might notice, are a little bit simpler. Yeah. Uh, in, in, particularly in their palette. So this is the first step onto the NES, and they, they hadn't quite figured out the gimmick they would, they would come to rely on, where they create multiple sprites for every character. Don't worry though, because it's a, a team sport, they did manage to overload the screen with so many sprites. This is probably the flickeriest game that was ever worth playing <laughs> in all of time. Yeah. So we'll do the, we're gonna, I guess we're picking the standard arrivals. Yeah. Riki and Kunio, Hanazono High versus Niketsu High. And this is specifically that additional wrinkle. We are still dealing with high school students. Just this is the additional detail. When Kunio is not being a delinquent who is running around beating up everyone who picks on his nerd friend, he's the captain of the high school dodgeball team. Yeah, sure. Yeah. That's what it is. So remember, we're in the quality up version that reduces flicker. <laughs> Oops. So, okay, uh, the, the basics of the controls are that you jump just like in a in a double dragon or or Ness Renegade. Right. And you pause with the plus button, like you just did. Okay. Uh and B Don't look at the controller to find B, but you know. Trust your instincts of what the which button is B on, on a NES controller. Actually now that I think about it, it is it is B on this controller too. You can look at the controller. Uh, B will be your attack throw and A will be your pass throw. And then I believe with timing, you can catch a throw that comes in. Okay, Unless and you kind of automatically go to whoever's closest to the ball. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, the intensely flickering characters are actually your current targets. 
Although, yeah. So now that I think about it, they really did do a great job of reducing flicker in this enhanced edition. It's just that the very odd design choice of in a game that in its native form runs with just like so much flicker you you, you see less of the characters than you see of just like the game like playing itself invisibly. They decided to make also flicker be a, a game mechanic. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. wild. Yeah. I, I never knew that. Because I, I had mostly played this game on the NES as a kid. This definitely... The first thing I'm noticing is that this 100%... Ooh! Super shot. How do you do a super shot? Uh, basically just run and throw it, and if you are capable of the super shot, you get it. Alright. That is everything that I know. The cooler the character, like, Riki and Kunio are, I think, more likely... Generally the team captains. Oh. Line violation, but in the rules of this game, as long as you stay on your own side, ha! <laughs> it's one of my favorite defensive manu maneuvers. Ah! So B is B is attack throw, and oh. and A is pass okay. to a teammate. So the two sprites that are flickering at any given time are your uh, your. Teammate who you will pass to and your enemy who you will throw at. <laughs> Impossible to tell that again in the standard version of the game. Whoops. Well, I ate that one while I was just in the game here. Yeah, this definitely set the set the expectation for what the the graphical style would be. Yes, like it's going to improve. And and then but like this code. is very different than say your river city. Ooh, that sent me a very fire. different from what river city uh, from not from river city ransom from renegade. Yes, definitely distinct from renegade, both the arcade version and the original NES port. So yeah, I mean, this is the game. I like you know you can imagine what the single player World Cup mode is like. You play a succession of more powerful teams. There's no like team. Ma well, there's team management in, this, in the extent that you could move people to different positions. If you're just like, what would the bald guy be like on offense? <laughs> you could. The, the game will let you do that. Although a recurring feature of the Niketsu games, the sports games, is that if you choose the Niketsu team, or if you're playing as them because you're in the campaign mode, you get a. a It's, it's, it's like a, what are they called? Murphy's, not Murphy's Choices. What kind of choice is it called when the Sophie's game... Choice? No! <laughs> no, it's a, it's, a, it's a video game term for choices that, uh, you know, like, but thou must, but thou must, where you don't really get a choice. You have a choice, but it never makes sense to not have Kunio in the lead position. He has yeah. way better stats than anyone else on the Niketsu team. Alright. It's all over but the crying now. I mean, it's not impossible for Toru here to to pull something out. To rally? You could, but I don't like. I don't love your odds. Huh? Big hit on Kunio. Ooh. Nah, that's it. Nah, I think he could have jumped that, but otherwise, yeah. So. <laughs> the, the so I don't think down. we need to go. Any further than that. Mm -hmm. uh, Super Dodgeball, very fun game. Yeah. Certainly establishes the art style that they would use going forward. It does. Although they hadn't technically, they hadn't mastered it from a technical standpoint yet. No. Uh, yeah, let's do the quality up version just because, like, we're mostly just talking about Flicker here. If it, yeah, if yeah, it yeah, feels yeah. weird, I've fairly recently done a replay of River City Ransom, like, a year and a half ago on the, on the Switch Online emulator with Totally42 if you're out there. I know you're not. Uh, <laughs> because you would have told us you in the chat. You could be. He would have told us. Get in the chat. And he's, he's, he's not in town, so he's probably got stuff going on. Uh, All right, so there's two player A, two player B, just like... Uh... And I think to be, you know, we're developing our beat-em-up skills throughout this series. We'll play it on B mode. The friendly fire mode. Uh, oh, wait, you know what, though? Here's something we probably should do. What's that? 
I think there might be a... I'm not, I can't remember if there's a story, but if, oh no, okay, no, we get dumped right to this. Great. So, if you played River City Ransom, mm -hmm. you can see what they, the, the localization, uh, focus, was sartorially focused. The faces did not change. Kuni and Ricky look the same. Yeah. When they become Alex and Ryan, I think. Yeah. But they dress more like an Alex and a Ryan. Like, jeans and t-shirts. Yeah, they're not wearing the classic 1980s uh, school uniform. Yeah, but these guys are. Okay. So, yeah. After one foray into sports, but certainly not the last. No. Uh, they're, they're like, alright, we're ready. We're ready to go back to dudes who uh, just beat each other up in the street. And we get a much different take. Cunio, what are you... I'm going to Rayo 2. Whatever. Ricky wants to save his girl. Kunio seeks an old friend. They head to Reho High. With their two goals linking them together, a blazing battle begins. So this is this is Ricky and Kunio teaming up for the first time in the lore. Nice. Okay. Because Why are they teaming up? I imagine that was in the uh, guidebook. In the instruction the manual. Yeah. But it's Ricky's girlfriend has been kidnapped. All right. Punch kick. Okay. Jump. Oh. So, this is my first time actually playing the uh, original, the Niketsu, oh, you get the money. Kunio version. Yeah, they drop money. Uh, so, another localization change in River City Ransom, instead of students from the different high schools, they are like uh, 50s sounding gang names, like mm -hmm. the Sharks and the, the Weasels and so forth. They have little lines of dialogue as yep. well while they get beat up. They have dialogue both for when they're fighting and for when you beat them. My favorite one was just on screen. Barf. And so we get a much different approach to uh, enemy or an encounter design Barf. than in the Double Dragon games. Instead of a small roster of unique repeating foes with their own movesets and such... There's just kind of a universal move set yeah. that uh, different enemies might have access to different moves from, I think. Yeah. Like, certainly we don't have access to the full move set, as we'll see pretty soon. I do enjoy beating people up with this baguette. I definitely think that's supposed to be a stick. Mm, are you sure? It's pretty baguette. <laughs> <laughs> so, very important to uh, avoid damage here, but also difficult to do. <laughs> I'm doing pretty good. Yeah, I'm, I'm not oh. doing great. Uh, Owie! It's not super important in the sense that, like, there's unlimited lives. It's just that advancement in this game, because this game uh, is has light RPG mechanics. Yeah. Advancement in this game comes from buying stuff at, in the, oh, wow. in the shopping districts. Here. And you lose half your money whenever you're knocked in. So there's a big incentive not to get taken down. And yeah. So hold on. Yeah. Okay. Okay. With the pause button, we can see some menus. Like we can check out, uh, see both characters' status. We start as extremely generic scrubs. Like we have 15 and everything. Yeah. But we can decide. How we want to develop. Can be more of a puncher or a kicker or a weapons user. Yeah, you'll you'll see. There's quite a bit uh, of stuff to get into, and then we can also look at how much money we've each got. Oops, but of course, in this, the select button will be the right shoulder button. Oh wow! Of course, it's recorded in yen. Yeah, of course. As opposed to in dollars. I think we're going this way. Uh, no, I don't think there is any. Uh, basically, if you can't go off the screen at any time, oh. then that's not the way to go. We've made it to the Hanazono Mall. So obviously we're setting out from Ricky's turf here. Here we go. Welcome! What can I get you today? Uh, I'll have a cream soda, please. Hi, go So for this it. game has a plethora of, of items you can buy. It's and very... You take them and then, Kunio drank the cream soda, defense went up. Hi. So, like, you just got, you have to learn through experimentation. Because there's a lot of different products to buy. 
defense boosted. Got some stamina back. Uh -huh. So stamina is our health. Yeah. That wasn't a huge... And my max yeah. stamina can't go up anymore at this time. Alright. I think that's enough for me. So, and then also, just some, some places, like here, you know, at the cafe, you're, you're expected to drink your drink while you're oh, there. Sorry, let me go back in. That's alright. Do we both have to go in? Why do we both have to go in? You just get nothing. Well, we I both, was just trying to get Sam. Yeah, yeah, now Kunio's just like awkwardly loiter. He's like, oh no, I'm, I'm, I'm just... No, uh, thanks, the other guy decided thanks. he really No, I, I, I was just here. I am, uh, I'm not just pure loitering. Ha, huh. sandwich. Yes, I like that nods. Look yeah. at that, ate my sandwich. So some places, like a little... Uh, Chility boosted? Bazillion Splunk, boost it. Stamina 28, boost it. Max Stamina 1, boost it. Anything else? Okay. Thanks. It's coming in. Very nice. Okay. Yeah. So all advancement in the game, like character advancement, is done through what you buy. Oh. And there's a lot of shops. Uh, so there is. Bakery! And they have a lot of products. And then you have no idea what any of them do. Except by buying them. Yeah. Alright. And then... Like, this donut shop is is a this bakery is a takeout place. They put yeah. in a little box for you. At the cafe, they expect you to eat there. There are some places that will ask you, "Do you want that for here or to go?" It's it's a pretty it's a cool little game. Yeah. Like, it's not like earth shatteringly complex. Like this is this, this is not an RPG. No, it has light RPG mechanics. But they're pretty. They're implemented in a cool way. So now, if I look at my items, do I have? A, I have a croissant. Yeah, and a cornet. A cornet. You eat the, the croissant. croissant. My agility's boosted. My stamina's boosted. Okay, and this would be helpful if I wanted to heal mid level. Yeah, as well. Nice. Right. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Like one stamina, not not huge. All right. But nice. yeah. You guys, another place. Sushi bar. Quality sushi. What'll it be? What, what are you having in etc? Oh, veggie rolls go to hell. Roll, the veggie roll. rolls. Okay, well. Is your Kunio a uh, vegetarian, James? He's not, but he is a uh, student of the game. He wants to save some money for the bookstore. I kind of suspect I can't afford anything at the bookstore right now, but. Cod Quality like, sushi. Lot, like, just a lot of options. Uh, I will have an egg, please. I ate the egg. My punch got boosted. My stamina got boosted. My max stamina. Anything else? Nope. In a way, it's almost prefiguring, like, the the Persona and Shin Megami, <laughs> Shin Megami it, Tensei. Games. You know what? It is, kind of. Yeah. Welcome! No, Here we go. Yeah, can't, can't afford, afford anything, but... I can I can tell you what these ones do. Yeah, well they they seem pretty straightforward. These that's, ones are straightforward. Well, screw attack. No, that one that's straightforward. Screw attack. Yeah. So screw attack is, I don't believe it was named this because of uh, Metroid, but it is a like jump and tumble like air, aerial attack. And then mock punch and mock kick are both just like throw three really quickly with a single press of the button. All right. Well, you know what? I'll save up for some of those. And then... Okay, then we're done. That, yeah. that was the shots. Sakajuku. Oh, I love that I can just hit people with the garbage can. Oh, yeah. And, uh... Lots... Don't let the money disappear. Oh, cool. yeah. I'm taking this one. You had your chance. Oof. Sorry. That's okay. Pl I'm playing this with Totally42. Uh... <laughs> I, I was getting knocked out by my friend on like every screen. It took us so long to advance in that game because I could never afford anything because he kept killing me. Yeah, so the school that the that they're from sets the palette of their of their uniforms yeah. and then their general stats and abilities. But then obviously it's just shuffling a preset bunch of heads to just make yeah. dudes. So very, very different approach. And then on top of that, who you meet in a given place is randomized. Not entirely, like just like an RPG. Who you tried to throw that chain at me, Ricky, but I kicked it out of the air. Uh, this one? 
explore. Much like, yeah, we can go up there. I oh, mean, we got it's kind of. We make our own choices. Oh, yeah. Shoot. Oh, yeah. There are some progression barriers, I think. Uh, but by and large, you can you can walk where you want to walk. Ah oh, man, I almost knocked it. Yeah, we'll be playing more defensively. WC. Yeah, so these guys, these guys can you know, get scared and run away. They'll use weapons. You can, Shh. Do you, you can hear loud siren. Thundering foghorn from outside. Holy Toledo! I love when the cruise ships roll into town and just. I love that you can just throw a baseball. Blow their horns, like, yeah, we saw you. You're like 18 stories tall. Yeah, it's impossible to miss you. Oh no, Kunio goes down. So that's it. That's. But yeah. Mamba. So you lose all your money? Half my money. Half your money. Oh, that's not as bad. It's pretty bad. Like, especially, like, later when you're trying to... So, this is a closed portion of the map, this little park. Uh, so, let's just run all the way back. Oh. And I'm back at full health, but with half my yen. Apologies, uh, folks, if you could hear that. Deafening, uh, screaming. Uh, I'm not apologizing. It, uh, you know, it's my life, man. That's true. <laughs> I've been living, jeez, quite a few years now on either side of the waterfront here. That's true. Before you lived here, you did live close Since to the... Since 2016, I've lived the barrier. right by the harbor. Okay, we should probably go back to the mall before you get knocked out. Oh yeah, I'm That's okay. There's a lot of, like, you know... A lot of risk reward, like how much further should I should we push this fighting out here when you're trying to save up for stuff? Alright. Because I'm so safe, I'm gonna and broke. I'm gonna take this guy out if I can get it. If I can pull it off. Yeah. Oh ah, he I'm bonked still himself. Here. I think that was me. No, it no. wasn't me. You can come back. Oh, you you can leave the person. screen and then change your mind and come back. Oh! Hello girls! Yeah, you just Ladies? Just NPCs! Yeah. Look at that. Nah, I can't afford anything here yet. And I certainly can't. So, we should, you should, you know, get some food. Oh yeah. I will buy... You gotta figure out what restores a lot of stamina. Well, I'll buy something expensive from the uh, sushi restaurant. Mm, maybe not something... Expensive! From the sushi restaurant. Isn't a bad bet by any means, but I don't, I don't know that it's a guarantee. Mm. And, you know, this this takeaway bakery isn't going to nah, offer you anything heels. expensive. What up? Hmm? Oh, but I'm up first, of course. Yeah, you're up first. My bad. Fortunately, you can just press B. Ah, Don't even have well, to scroll good. down. What's... Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Just looking. Just looking. Wanted that one? Yep. Yeah. This is the sushi. No, this is the cafe. All right. I'll go to the cafe. Yeah. I would like some... I should get something somewhere just to get some stats up. Stamina 32, just... max stamina is maxed out. Anything else? Yeah, I will take some tea. Tea and toast. Tea and toast. I just eat the whole mug. Yeah. Energy 4 boasted. Anything else? Okay. Uh, no, I don't want Drink coffee. Go with my tea. Jeez. Anything Ricky is just... fired up. Uh, yeah, I'm all good. Oh my. Okay, let's get... I'm gonna get something. Ah, that's just off. That's the edge of that. That's leaving. Uh, let's go to the sushi place. I'll get some sushi. Alright. Probably can't afford any quality sushi. Oh, you can, yeah, oh. you can afford the cheapest of the quality. Wow, that's like all my money. Yeah. Nah, nah, let's just keep it normal. Get yourself uh, give some me squid. Some unagi, please. What do we get for Unagi? Defense, that's good. Full health. Ah, boost my max stamina. Excellent. Nice. nice. So, eel at least. 
It makes you hardier. I will also take some eel then. You eat the eel, you get a parasite. Aww. Yeah. Alright. No, I'm all good. Alright, let's get going. You kind of just scurry when you move fast. Yeah. Whoa! Senra die. So I like the addition of blocking. Yeah. Which is basically, as far as I understand, as far as I know, is just triggered by timing. Like if you're hitting an attack at the same time as the enemy, then either he's gonna block your attack, or you're gonna block his. Huh. I think that's how it works. But it's certainly it's a just makes the even when you're not really thinking about how to do it, because it just kinda happens. I think it does make the fights themselves seem a little more dynamic. Whew, careful! Well, we so, can collapse. Uh, just like in Double Dragon and in life, you want to avoid falling into open construction pits. How do I come back? Uh, I just gotta leave the screen. Okay. Did I lose half my money? Oh, you've lost half your money. God dang. A boss. Sawaguchi, Nishimara says punks like you can't pass. Unless you beat me, that is. Oh, man. Well, hold on. Sawa. Alright. Yeah, we'll Maybe fight him help? later. We'll deal with him in time. Uh, okay, how do I make a yen wise? Oh, not well. <laughs> oh, brass nuts. Okay, these guys have gotten tougher. They have the ability to pick us up and throw us now. Yeah, these guys are definitely a step up. Which is good, probably, because uh, that's also what determines the value of money drops. Nice. In fact, we could probably do a fair bit towards learning... Right. There we go. Learning... One thing that could help us figure out the tougher gangs is if we watched our money screen. Okay, so they're giving us 70 yen per drop. Lime green uniforms, 70 per drop. 70 yen, or seven cents. Yeah, it's not a ton of money. And no. they, they, that's very, like in the game, you're very much like beating people up for change in hopes of purchasing a book yeah. on how to better well, like, beat people up. Yeah. You are trying to save up for like a $20 purchase over the course of like the beating of several games. Did you want to go over to the side area again? Well, I don't think we're ready to beat the boss. Let's go in the park. Yeah, all right. Students from Numoaka. Oh, same, same school we just beat up, so. 70 per. Yeah, that's good stuff. There's baseballs here. I'll have a baseball. Yeah, the quality up emulation is really good. I really like what they've done with it. Oh, I just wanna... Okay, oh, you are geez. quite badly hurt. I was really not uh, aware that I'd been beaten so severely. I'll just, uh, I'll let Ricky do his thing here. Uh, I'm gonna keep going. Until we flee back to the mall so I can have some unagi. He's punching where you where you are, but where he cannot beat you. So that's good. You're, you're drawing the... Uh... It's like he's shaking, he's, he really wants to just get... Oh no, no! Yeah, I got some knucks. I got the knucks. Some brass knuckles. There we go. Right. Get back. Do you have... You need to buy some bakery goods. I have some... Oh man. Hold yeah, on. Whatever I have, I should eat, because probably it's. Uh, I don't. I don't. A donut's gonna give me enough. But let's see. Can you eat the donut? I'm more resilient. Oh, I got a little stamina. Max stamina is max stamina. Look at that. Yeah. You're, you're back to one. It's not earth shattering. No. But I'm hanging in there. You okay with the cornet there? Yeah, I'm all good. 
Wouldn't a cornet be like a drumstick? Like an ice cream? I think it might be just like a, a shared word. Like we call the ice cream a cornet because of the... Okay. Because of whatever it is. I was going to say, that's not really a great carry around uh, treat. That's good to carry around if it's a cold day. Like, if you're eating it, you can carry it around. I just mean, like, you shouldn't put it in your backpack and, oh, uh, leave me alone, dude. You and your thuggish forehead. Oh, I picked him up. How did I do that? We're losing a bit of the bottom of the screen here. Let me mess with the filter. All right. I'm happy with my health. I'm gonna stick where I'm at. That'll probably be enough. Tiny you cannot punch and kick while you are in the, uh, the store area. So. No, no, we're civilized goons. So, did you want to get some uh, sushi or some cafe? I should try something new. I'm gonna try a different sushi. Alright. Because the sushi was uh, pretty nutritious. Uh, but this is the thing you get trapped in a loop here where it's like, you know. If I'm spending all my yen. Uh, you'll never be able to save up. You know what? I, in fact, the unagi is right in the like sweet spot. I don't want to go to spending 600 yen, but I don't want to step down in quality if that's what the squid's gonna be. Right. I'll give it a shot. Get that eel. Defense is going up. Stamina's getting boosted, so you're gonna be harder to hit and stronger. Huh? Okay. Thank you, sir. I'm gonna try an etc. Let me try one of these, uh, these cheaper rolls here. I'm gonna go with the, uh, tuna roll. I would, yes, I would like a tuna roll. Ba, ba, ba. This is very fun. This is... Yeah, like, very simple, but <laughs> it's just like, the, the enormous range of options, and most yeah. of them, it, it, and like, all of them are literally just different toggles on the stat boosts, but it's just like, it just feels really cool. And I understand why they Americanized it. I, as a kid, would have thought it was way cooler. to be like, whoa! They're like, in Japan. <laughs> I wouldn't have even known, like, that would be before I knew a single thing about Japanese culture. No, this would have been all you knew that, about that Japanese culture. That wasn't a concept. ninja, you know. Contempt. Oh man, I'm almost down already. I'm not making money here. Certainly not getting any closer to purchasing. Right. The item controls. I guess that's a that's a beat 'em up innovation here. In that yeah. every item uh, fully takes over your move set. Yeah. Uh, and then the, the kick button throws any item, while the A button attacks with any item. In Double Dragon, a throwing item is just a throwing item. And you can, you can still kick when you're holding anything. So you, you only need one officially assigned button. This is much more obviously a bat because it's aluminum. Yeah. The uh, the other one was pretty clearly, I thought, up again. Up again. All right, I gotta go back to the mall. You gotta go back to the mall already? This is, this is uh -huh. like, a lot of the gameplay loop, especially early, uh, is, is about f making a little foray out because, like, so I, I didn't make up the money. No, I gotta try something else. I didn't make back the money that I spent last time. So, huh? let's go to the cafe. Let's go to the cafe. Get and... yourself a sandwich or some toast. <sighs> Cream soda's nice. Uh, it didn't do much in terms of stamina, though. Yeah. I think I don't know the coffee did. You know what? Toast. Toast. And toast is yeah. I mean, thirty-two. Yeah, That's 32. like half stamina. Yeah. It's not great, but it's... We're working on it. Like, it's a it's a tight economy. It is. In this game. But that, like... It works. It works for the game. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> like that. Oh. Ouchie. That's how real tough guys win fights. Just Have your tough friend distract the guy from the front. And just punch him in the back of the brain with brass knuckles. It is it is quite the move to hit your friend 
just throw a pair of glass knuckles at somebody. Yeah, when they're down, they're an object. Nice. Oh, sorry. Same controls. A to smash somebody with them and B to throw them. <laughs> if I remember correctly, they often like recover in midair when you throw them. What the hell did you just do? I ran into the gatepost there. Which is the thing you gotta watch out for. Because you do lose health if you run into obstacles. Many a tragic uh, loss of half your money comes when you're trying to flee back to the mall. And you run into something. Yeah. That's, ooh, more guys. I got it. So how are we doing? You're doing great. I'm not really picking out much money. I'll try, I'll try a little harder here. And you will try extremely hard. Not to uh, dive immediately into the trap. We are not in boss fighting mode, so we should probably skedaddle. Yeah, okay. No need to poke the bear until we've toughened up a bit. Maybe read a book about fighting. I assume the, the mock kick book says like, have you tried kicking three times really fast? Oh. Oh, okay, okay. All right. Okay, yeah. Speaking of. I'm at 2,000. How much is the cheapest book? Oh, more than 2,000. Is it 3,000? No, but more than 2,000. <laughs> Just, Just close it in. I'm gonna step forwards while moving my legs like this, and if you get hit. Alright. Alright. I'm done. Hold on. Oh man, Ricky no. <laughs> okay. So I didn't realize we made it back. like that. Okay. I I mean I earn the money that I need to buy myself an eel roll. Uh I'm gonna try something more expensive. I will go off the quality sushi menu and see what I can get. Not me. Keeping it normal. Keeping it normal. Just keep staying humble. Defense 2 boosted, stamina 16. Mm. Okay, that's not actually a good stamina boost. Nope. Okay, I also then gotta go to the cafe and have some coffee or something. Toast. Toast In fact, that stamina do. boost didn't give me a single bar. I, I'm gonna go with the cod row. Cheapest thing on the quality menu, let's see what happens. Punch one up, energy two boosted, stamina 40 boosted. Max stamina is maxed out, okay. Oh, okay, just your bars don't appear until we both had something for some reason. All right. That's well, fine. Let's go over the bakery then. Okay. But not the bakery, so the uh, cafe. Yeah, and then we'll remind remind ourselves the prices on our way out. Ugh. This is, this yeah. is, all, this is all my money. And it's two boosted, stamina 16 boosted. Max stamina is maxed out. It's, there not, you go. it's not a great boost either, but it's cheaper. Actually, it's barely cheaper. Okay. <laughs> you gotta figure this no, out. It, you gotta it, figure out the math on this and, one. Like, as soon as you figure it out, you're on to a different mall. <laughs> and, oh, yeah, this is only mall one, eh? Yeah. The, like, as we travel through Japan, we will Are we'll the books different the malls. same? Oop. No. The no, no, there are advanced tech. We should not move on from this until, until we like, each of us should have a mock move, probably. Unless you want to go for screw attack. But each of us should have one cool move before we try to leave here. Oh, man. How did I get down? Oh, wait. No, I was up to four. I don't even remember getting hit since we've been on this screen. So carelessness is a big problem for me. <laughs> in uh, in River City Ransom. Or downtown Niketsu story. Downtown Niketsu story. Because we're downtown. Yeah. You know, I never played this game on NES. Uh, because... I must... I don't know if... I feel like... I know I've heard of it. I don't know if I ever saw it. Because I feel like if I looked at the box, I would have been like, That's the dodgeball guys! And would have been really excited. <laughs> but... The, what are they up to now? When we I heard the name... Up. It never appealed to me. Turn it, 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 River City Ransom, I don't know. It just didn't say to me, like, this is a cool beat of my fair PG. I don't know. I, I think uh, Dodgeball and the first 
Soccer, which was called Nintendo World Cup or something when they brought it here, were the only ones that I... That makes sense. ...played on a NES. Even though, uh, obviously, this, as River City Ransom. And uh, I think the later track and field game came here as Crash and the Boys. Crash and the Boys? Yeah, which I heard of. I remember when I was in, like, the sixth grade, a uh, friend of a friend, I mean a friend, but, like, a, a friend who I basically only hung out with when I was with another friend, Yeah. Uh, was like, I have all these, like, old Nintendo powers that I'm gonna just, like, throw out. And I was like, he was like, do you want them? And I was like, of course. Of course, yeah. Of course I want to read a bunch of, like, five-year-old video game magazines. Oh, uh, man. And so I read them all constantly, and so I would hear of these games that I'd never played. I was like, man, I love, because I, I loved a good track and field game when I was a kid. But I never, I never played Crash and the Boys or River City Ransom until emulators. And then when I found out, oh, this is all actually a single series with a coherent character. And they all exist, and you can play them all on emulators. Oh, it was a happy day. I played so much of every game in this series mm -hmm. as a kid. Of the NES series. I haven't played much of the... Uh, there's, I think there's two Kunio beat em up RPG uh, hybrids on Super I'm gonna Nintendo. get out of here before I die. But yeah, me too. Alright, good work, team. Anyone else coming? Anybody else want some? You're down. What? You gotta be careful charging off screen. You ran into something off screen. No! Yeah. How is this possible? Alright. It's. I ran yeah. into something else. There's nothing in the middle. How could I? Who did I run it, into? There's a generic off-screen obstacle. Oh you, my you, god! You want to run up to the edge of the screen, stop running, and then walk off the screen. Absolute, absolute travesty. Oh, I have full health though. Yeah. That's so, nice. sure, but you were almost. I was. You were almost I was book almost buying. to a book. Yeah, that's exactly what I was. I was doing. All right. What are you doing for me, sandwich? Agility. Okay. Resilience. Resilience. Stamina thing too. There. Like half stamina. I can Sweet. work with half stamina. It's not great, but it's something. I'm good. I'll pass. I'm full health. I just want a book. What's this way? Nothing, right? Hmm? The other way Just is... the, like, opening yeah. fighting in front of Hanazono High. I don't know what... Oh, man, Kunio. Kunio gets just absolutely devastated by any damage. And I suppose Ricky must too, but... We're just taking less. Plus you're, you started from full, which probably helps a lot. Oh yes, for sure. And like, you know, you really don't want to be taking weapon shots in this game. I do love this art style. There's something about it. The way oh, it's, it's terrific. It's so, it's so charming. Like it's... they maintain this art style even in the, in the current games. Yeah, like there's a, obviously this, you know. Yeah, they didn't on Super Nintendo. I think they went for, at least the the Kunio beat 'em up that I have played. No, no. Could have saved me there, Ricky. All right. I was coming in. No, it's okay. I know it was just so close. That. Anyway, okay. I'll easy just... come, easy go. At least I get oh, full health. Yeah, you've, you know what? You've cleared him out. Yeah, I have. You can afford to run off the screen now because. It'll flip the page. All right. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, well. well I'm not buying anything. Back again? Okay. Yeah. Off we go. Aha! That's what you needed. You needed that reset. There we go. Yeah, so it, it's just such a. Oh, man. Sorry. Get it from, from all sides. Oh, no, no, no! Let's pass the back over there. Oh, yeah. Kunio! Bad. Kunio! Kunio! Ah, the throws get a little, uh... A, at least a thrown chain has, like, a little reach on that Z-axis. Like, you move up, but it's it can still catch you. Like, it's spinning, I guess. Ah! Go back. 
I want to go back, but like I don't really. I, you got you got to buy some toast, man. Yeah, I mean I I get stats. The stats are all I'm getting out of this. Uh, I gotta try something new. Try something I haven't tried. Give me some tea, please. Yeah, I'll try it. Try anything once. <laughs> Eat the whole coffee. Eat the whole okay, coffee tea is nothing but energy. I don't even know what that is. Me neither. All right. You could have also bought a sandwich. Oh, you couldn't have. No. The money for a sandwich. No, my all my hopes are on getting beaten unconscious in the streets here, so that I get a nap and I wake up and get, get my health back. All right. Meanwhile, I'm doing pretty okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you're doing well. You're doing well. Oh, did you want to okay. get some? I food? might as well spend all my money because I'm about to get knocked out. Yeah. Hey, get some bakery goods. Heal yourself in the, in the field. Oh wait, no, not bakery goods because those are field goods. I want to just eat something now that will boost my stats. Get some sushi. All right. The exit. Some good good. Some sushi. Can we check the price on books as well before we leave? Yes. <sighs> Go with some I'll eel. take the Inagi, please. Is that what you would like? It's what I accept I can afford. Oh, I mean, I, I suppose I should be boosting my uh, defense, but jeez. It does, I mean, that's that, you know, a good RPG, like mechanically a good RPG gives you a feeling of progression and development mm -hmm. and without even having progressed yet you can see how we will easily experience that in the course of this game yes <laughs> okay hold on let's look at our respective stati yeah my defense is like my oh, mean it's insane. thing yeah i really don't know what energy does most of these are pretty uh intuitive self but... toy, yeah yeah I don't know. I guess at some point we should look up what the friggin' stats mean and do. Mom. Ah. My punch is very strong, but the issue with punch is that all the enemies back away from you so slowly and progressively. Yeah, like, I believe there, there is still a slight reach advantage to a kick. Oh yeah, you can see it. Yeah, a punch barely expands upon you. Uh, barely expands past your sprite. But a punch, but a kick, ooh. Speaking of the Z-axis, if you stand on the fence, you can kick an enemy on the ground in the face. Nice. So there's... there's... Kunio is... Well, you're just looking to pass out, eh? Can I... Yeah, well, I'm not buying anything, so... Not for a hundred bucks. Not for a hundred yen. Okay, so... What we should do here is uh, focus on getting you paid. Yeah. I'll be in a supporting role. I won't pick up any money. And I'll try not to punch you directly. Seeing as we are playing with the... Uh, friendly yeah. fire. Friendly fire. I feel like you gotta. I feel like the, the experience makes more physical sense with it on. And it adds a real... Like, there is certainly a cha more challenge involved in fighting a, not really a mob, since you're only ever fighting two guys at a time, but there is challenge involved in fighting two guys at a time when you're worried about not knocking out your friend. Uh, getting paid. Getting, well, not laid. These boys are no. eternally virginal. I don't think that's true. No. All right, back to the main map. Go back to the main square, I guess. Alright, we're fighting some pinks. Classic pinks. I do like that these guys the will eventually money. jump out of your uh, jump out of your arms. Yeah. yeah. They will not just stand and take being carried around like a chump. Yeah. Now, these are ultimately like we're not fighting nerds. We're fighting all the cool tough guys from every school in town. All right, Ricky, it's time for you to take a level up. It's time for me to get knocked out here. Yeah. Well, you you take the beating, and I'll well, okay, goodbye. Now I'm not giving them the satisfaction. Wow. Just run headlong into a post. All right. 
Give myself a good solid concussion. Okay. Here we go. I'm back in it. I'm broke as a joke. But that's right. fine. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no! it is 3,000. Okay. You lied to me. I thought it was less than. I you thought it was like 2,700. To... Okay. <laughs> what are you thinking? Are you favoring mock punch or mock kick? I'm favoring kick. Because of the range. Because of the range. Whoa! Did you see the height Kunio got on that jump? Yeah, I know. I wonder. It does depend on if you're running or not. Well, certainly. But I wonder if also like the energy stat modifies your ability to jump or something like that. I certainly didn't do a super jump there. Although on the way down, when I kicked the guy, I got a little like bounce where I stayed mid air a little longer. There's a like. Even now, this is already a really well-developed two-on-two fighting engine. Yeah. Uh, there will eventually be a game that is just a... Uh, I don't know. I can't remember what it's called officially. The ROM... In the emulation days, they just called it Ricky Cunio. Ricky Cunio. And it's just a two-on-two, -two, like... It's like there's a fighting league. And just Ricky and Cunio are taking it on. Okay. I'm gonna lead... Okay, we're definitely not taking the risk fighting this boss. And you be careful. I know, but I want the money. Okay, you got the money. Alright, let's All get right. back. Taking no risks. We're taking you back so you can learn to read. Wait. Oh wait, you probably already know how to read, but... It's not reading that I'm learning, it's... It's the thing that you read about. Why did you... I did not think about the whole invisible obstacle just off screen. Oh. Oh, no. Stop. Stop engaging in the fight, Greg. Stop. Well... Run. Just run. Just... I can't! Oh! The pain. That's a 1,500 so yen. It's a 1,500 yen. What? <laughs> Knocked out. Okay. Uh, you get some money. Aha! Thanks, pal. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't mean to hit Yoshi, did you? Yeah. Run for it, Naka. No, I have the chain. Nah, no. Alright. Well, that sucked. That really sucked. Come on, get that. And... Well, let's look. It'll hurt. There it goes. Okay. Back up we go. Easy come, easy go. Ah, oh, damn it. We're not going to be playing the arcade version, but graphically, how... There is no arcade version of this. Oh, sorry. Yes, of course. You were talking about the uh, the dodgeball. But yeah. Like, but graphically for dodgeball... If I how, remember how correctly, it's... It, the thing is that I'm probably... There's a TurboGrafx-16 or PC Engine uh, uh, dodgeball, and there's also a Super Nintendo one. And there they use a style that apes this, but the characters are like broader too. Okay. Uh How can I get here we go. And then the at least the one of the two beat em ups on the Super Famicom that I've played goes back to the Renegade style of graphic. Just a, a like a more realistic tough guy coming up. Mm-hmm. See how much how much money are these guys get? Fifty. Fifty's not bad. It's not bad. I ain't gonna say no to fifty bucks. No. Fifty yen now. Well, I I won't say no to five cents either. Yeah. Okay. Did this guy's not carry money? There we go. Like I don't know what was the average income of a Japanese delinquent in the 1980s. I have no idea. But like, you know, probably not that much. They have like, you know, some some change for the arcade. They'll make, get most of the change by beating up nerds at the arcade. That's true. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Nice. Ooh. 
nailed me with that dude. Sorry. It's alright. It's terrifying me there. Yeah, if by now I've done it, you mean now I've knocked your ass out. Okay. Oh! You might as well just keep grabbing him for now. Alright. I need something. Do you want some sushi? But not much. Uh, yeah, I want sushi, but not the eel roll. Alright. I want to see what, uh... I don't know. The best normal sushi. One step up from meal. Shrimp. Shrimp? It's half my money, but maybe it's, it's what good. What do you like? What do I get? What do I get for it? Resilience two. Whatever resilience is. Stamina I've got it. thirty-two. Okay. Max stamina is maxed out. Anything else? But yeah. Okay. It's That's a good great. heal. It's a good heal. I'll take that. I will. Uh, I'll set to the work over here of finding out what the stats are. Right. Well, you have to control the uh, page here. Whoops! I thought I'd already exited. No, no, no. Let me hit up etc. Let me get a. F Let me get a fat roll. Give me that fat roll. Stamina 14, max stamina. So that's just pure stamina. All right. All right. Okay. So your defense stat influences the likelihood of you blocking when you're fighting with a guy. Okay. Uh, and then resilience. One second. I had resilience on here. And this whole thing jumped around. Resilience is used to determine the likelihood of enemies knocking you down, as well as how uh, how best the character gets up upon huh. being knocked down. And uh, sometimes it'll keep you alive when you're knocked out. Right, but when you have zero health, it'll... it'll... But, yeah, but I don't think that happens much at our level. Okay, here we go. I'm here ready. Go. Ah, I said I was ready. And I went down. I like these guys with the glasses. Yeah, it bespeaks a confidence to fight with sunglasses on. Like, with glasses, it might just be, you know, not ideal, but it's what you gotta do to see. The trick to that guy was to turn my back on him and he gained confidence that he could get me. Yeah, that's, uh, you know, every every fighter has heard the, uh, the saying, you know, try giving that dude your back. <laughs> Have you tried See what happens. <laughs> Maybe he'll fuck up. <laughs> uh, we keep going yeah. to check money simultaneously. There we yeah. go. All right. We're on the same mind as to when best to check money. Yeah, which makes sense. I am, uh, Christ, I'm not making money at a rate that will feed me <laughs> for how bad I'm getting beaten down. Did you want to go back to death? I think we should... Okay. Nah, as long as these dudes keep coming. These 70 yen suckers. Right. I'm not gonna buy anything. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna put it all on the line here. Alright. Ah! Always taking that jerk running in at the start. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Money here. Sixty for the pink guys. So greens are the are the tough ones of the three. At this point, yeah. uh, presumably oh, future enemies will There are many, there are many more, more schools. Money. Yes. Yeah. And, and indeed. I guess we are become... in Tokyo. Yeah. There are hundreds of schools in Tokyo. Yes. Oh yeah. I'd like to fight the specialty school where their specialty okay. is ceramics. No. I think one thing we've learned here is that at least until we get you over that uh, that book hump, we should not go more than one screen from the mall. Ah. Okay. Let's buy some money. Twenty six twenty. Let's look at you. You're okay. I'm fine. You're. Okay. I'm not though. I should buy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, fine. Buying that eel roll. <laughs> you're just you. You're keeping yourself an eel. I, I think I need the shrimp roll though, it was better. 
Yeah, it is better. It sucks to be. It also costs, uh... So much yen. Six tenths of your money. You can reduce that. Three fifths of your money. I'm good. Right. Okay. I do love how we sort of scurry. I don't like how we always start with you at the top and me at the bottom. Because it throws me off every time. I want to just... Well, here's what I'll say to that. Because it happens every time, it should eventually stop throwing you off. Nope. It will, it will throw me off if every time. If it sometimes switched our order, that would be really annoying. There we go. You throw them fast enough, they can't recover in the air, and they take damage on the landing. Oh! Oh, man. That dude just took me right down. Come on! With a single combo. And I... Alright. These on, guys, guys have high defense. They the do, greens yeah. are by far the toughest. They have high damage output relative to the other two schools at this level. Uh, I don't know. Okay, I'm out. I don't care about you. I want my friend back. Alright. I got nothing to spend and you're so close. Yeah, let's just go. Okay, and let me do the fighting. Stay away. I will leave the money drops for you. Cool. And then we'll go and buy... Oh, back. there's nobody here. Nobody's <laughs> using this turf. Okay, we're coming right back from the park. We're not fighting in the park. Oh, what did I ask you to do? Stay safe. Sometimes oh, no, no, I took the money. Okay, here, get this guy's money. Come on, one more. Come on, pink guy. Just take a punch. Ah. Uh, there we go. Okay, that's it. That's all I need. Come, come. Hold on. No, let me. You're not gonna. You. If you stay off the screen, you're fine. There. Okay. Alright, to the bookstore. And then get knocked out. Okay. Oh no, I can't afford anything. I'm just reading the backs today here. Alright, I'm gonna go with that match kick. It is what I want. Thank you very much. We could got the match kick. Anything else? No, I have $20. Yeah. 20 yen. Well, I mean, to be fair, just... she doesn't know that. Yeah, that's true. She's just doing she her job. See it. You're yelling at her about how you're broke. Can't you see that I'm broke? How would I be able to see that, sir? So how do you activate the mock check? Am oh! I, am I doing it now? Oh, no, no, hold on. Gotta read that book. Oh, hi. Right. I forget. I think you read about the match kick. You learned the skill. Match kick! Oh. Uh, okay, yeah, exit. Good stuff. There we go. Yeah. So that's, oh, uh, that. well, I mean, you can see why that's good. So enjoy it. Well, oh, man. Well, if there's ever a time to get knocked out, it's when you're never landed me a one. All right. Yeah, leave my health up so that I know as soon as I'm getting my ass kicked at all, I will flee, but. Yeah, there's never a better time to. I gotta uh, start making money. Make some money. I can sit here. Yeah, I'm done. I took. Oh, the, you're done. I took them out. There weren't many. Oh, I'm good. Yeah, you're not buying anything with you. <laughs> they divided your your very little money. They're like, no, nah, this is just no. This there divides to zero. Is that Taka? Oh yeah, that feels good. It works on you too. So if you uh, have you watched any or read any about the all the preview footage and, and preview plays of uh, AEW Fight Forever? I have, yeah. I I'll say this right away. Um, I like that they're going for a more stylized look. Oh yeah. And feel like I think ultra realistic, especially for the fact that professional wrestling. Is yes. It's just it's not necessary. Don't go off the. Uh, I was trying. 
There we go. You land one of these kicks and you're good. Takes care of him. There we go. Okay. Did you want to take him on? Or no? Uh... Or you got health wise. Uh, you can give it a try. We can try. Yeah, you're not obliged to let him get through his villain speech. What? 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 Ooh, ouch. Got him. Does he drop a thick load? He sure does. Ding. Map. 220. 220. This one? Forward? I... I... My, my memory tells me there's no way to go to the right here, and it's uh, true. Uh, uh. So we can go up. Or we can go back. Well, let's go. Oh, we're at the mall. second mall. I still don't have a like. I need to. Get, let's see if they also still sell mock punch and mock kick here at the bookstore. Cause like. Welcome. I need nope. a move. Different stuff. Whoa, these are completely. Not every book is a learn a move book. Is no cuts a learn a move book? Do you think being three thousand? Might be. Guy's book seems like, pretty good. Guy's book, definitely not. Like lost love. Should I should I buy wind song just for the hell of it? Yeah, you can. I'm not gonna stop you. I would. I would like some wind song. Like the, Thank you very much. Unless you're gonna take half the fun out of the game by like having a wiki open and never buy anything that's not optimized. Uh, I want to read wind song. See what there's it's only about. one thing to do, and that's to read the books. I think you read the wind song. A refreshing breeze blew through Wiki's body. Defense two boosted. Energy three boosted. All right. Yeah. So some of them are just stack. Stack gainers. Stack gainers, yeah, sure. And some of them teach you moves. Usually it's pretty clear which ones are going to teach you moves. Yeah, the ones that are super expensive. And, you know, that have names like Mock Kick. I think No Cuts might be one. It's 3,000, but I can't imagine what No Cuts means. It's not clear, let's put it that way. What? Oh, you can refight bosses. Oh, nice. Can I try him again? I'll let you get the coin this time. Yeah, that'd be great. Cool. Okay, great. Did I kill you? You killed me. I didn't know your health was that low. I was just trying to put you down. Yeah. Okay, if well, you if you get me picked up by mistake, or if I vice versa. Come on. You j you gotta. Uh, just let me get up. I'm sorry. If you throw me while I'm still stunned. No, it's all right. Like I said, my my most recent uh, playthrough of River City Ransom was also uh, like just a struggle for me to advance at all because of being constantly killed by my partner. So. I'll take some salmon rice. Can we get some salmon? Would you like anything else? Oh, these are for That's to go. Later. Let's take away. Uh... Well, I don't want any takeaway right now. I want something a little media, as media as I can. Let's try some sushi. Here's another sushi restaurant. All right. Okay, I can't afford any of this. No, you cannot. It might be worth it just to go get knocked out. Well, let's go backwards anyway. Come on. There we go. I need a move before we can advance. I know. Well then, I want to try, I'm not going to be able to save up for screw attack, but I want to try to do something different than it. Like, I've had a tendency to just be very focused on just get my one. Uh, oh dear. A bold move. It's very, like, sandboxy is, oh man. Yeah, see that, that was what had me on the ropes previously. It's just that this guy does a ton of damage as a boss. He does. Oh, 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 come oh. on. No, no, no. Good of him to, uh... Yeah, let you recover. Okay, I think I've got him. You got, got him. him. Alright. Okay. Heading back towards the original mall. I'm Sakajuku back. students. And I still got my mock kick, so... Oh, come on. No, no, no. Leave me alone. Alright. 
You wanna get off screen? And, uh, no. Well, no, I'm dead. Well, of course, that won't help you then. I'll just gather some coins until these guys go away. Come on. Come on. Go. I'm just realizing. Oh. You're back. I suspect you need to re resurrect me in the mall. I was trying to, but then I accidentally went ah. in the wrong place. Punching someone in the back of the head, never a bad strategy. Yeah, if you throw me when I'm standing, it's like I did a really high jump. I can do moves and stuff. But if you throw someone while they're stunned, you're just pitching them on their head. Yeah. You're just feeling them. So where are you at money-wise? Oh, we're, we're ages away. Yeah. What do you want to do, James? Hmm? What do you want to do? What's your move? I just have to make money. All right. I'm never going to have a move if I don't make money. Okay. Just back to the mall and step over. I don't think I need to buy anything. I mean, in fact, I, I have a real need to not buy. There, that worked out. You get this money. I'm happy with my move set. I can picture playing this game for just hours, though, just oh, to buy yeah. every book. It's, uh, it's so simple, in a way, but, like, well, yeah, like, obviously simple, and repetitive, and yet, it's so moment-to-moment -moment satisfying, and the, the character development, like, the, the RPG mechanics give you something to strive for, and mm -hmm. it's just a, I love this game. It's a wonderful game. It has a much uh, lesser known and heralded sequel that we'll also be playing. What's that one? Uh... I couldn't tell you the official Japanese name, but it's something to be, basically it's called like Niketsu period piece. And just they, oh, they yeah. drew little top knots on uh, Ricky and Kunio and put them in a... Okay, please don't kill me. Well, I did it. You I did it. I did. It. I yep. did. No, this, I, this, I is, killed you. this is just what it's like for me to play River City Ransom. I'm sorry, my man. It's all right. I'll just That's... go through the game with regular punches and kicks. <laughs> um, Do you want to advance? Just see what's next? Uh, what's next might actually... Uh, I can't remember. So actually, I think we just keep going forward for now. Huh. Maybe we'll meet some tougher gangs, but somehow not There's get killed yet. by them. There's lots of stores here. Uh, we can check out the lot. stores. Fast food, burgers, drinks, etc. Yeah, like they have nested... like. They obviously had a ton of fun just like yeah. coming up with item names and like shops. Now, how much of this would have been given away, do you think, in the original instruction manual? Because we don't have access to that. I would right honestly now, so bet on have... very, very little. I think so too, but I think at least maybe like a menu would have been given to you. It'd be like, eat, a, eat some tea and you'll get this. I'm honestly, I'm not confident that that's true. Just for one, not for, not for all the shops. Okay. So I just, just realized that. There's no, we don't need to see the pink borders of the emulator. Oh, I love the pink borders of the emulator. Huh. <laughs> they fill me with such joy. Well, you'll just have to remember them. Better. So taking them away. Okay. Perfect. Recenter it. Very nice. Okay. Nothing today for me, please. I'll try a burger. I will have one tech burger, please. Uh. Does that correlate to a type of fish? I'm not sure. I took it to go, so we'll, we'll I'll eat it on the road. All right, let's go. I also have some. Oh yeah, right. Treasure River. An NPC. What's up, Kunio? I've got news for you. The girl 
who was taken by the dragon bros. Oh, well, shit. She's on the top floor of the school. They shut her up in that red corner room. If you want to save her, you'll have to beat them both. Both of them. They're super strong, so power up. Don't overdo it. I'm from Riho, but I'll be cheering you on. Oh, goodbye. So, I think hereafter, enemies will spawn at the bridge. But but that was just to give us a little introduction. So but for the well. NPC meetup, oh, geez, I just slightly missed on both sides. It's going to drive me crazy. Oh, yeah, I can see that. That's worse. That's worse than when it was full size. Okay. One more. One more? One more. There you go. Okay. Okay. It's bearable now. Alright. Onward. Underway. Alright, we got some... Hoshikusa students! How much do they give? Let's see. 110. Nice! That means they're also gonna just beat the shit out of us. Well, so far we're doing pretty good. Yeah, it helps that they're now clustering. I do love these tires. There's something very Lego tire about them. Yeah, they have a... I don't know. They have that feel. <laughs> For sure. Of just like a non-inflated tight rubber must stretched mm -hmm. over like a gear. Alright, so that's... So, we're heading towards a school now, yeah? We have a mission. Eventually, yeah. Oh, big fit. But it's not a linear journey. What is... Are they digging a pool? What are they doing here? Oh, uh, they're digging something. And it's a work in progress. Maybe they're installing a skate park. Probably not. Oh, we have money-wise. Oh, we're gaining money much quicker now. Yeah. Oops. That's okay, I blocked it. I heard the little yes. dink noise. I want to pick up this ball. Throw it at the back of your head. Yep. No, I shan't. I'll hold off. Okay. What is this? I think we've cleared this place out, but... Is this the school? Yeah, this is gonna be... This is not the school. <laughs> the game is not almost over. Uh, no. Oh, that's the end of the game. Yes, the goal of the game is to save the girl. Is to beat the dragon bros. So let's see here. These oh, no! Guys. No! Oh, oh actually, right I have here. a ton of life. Okay, hold on. How much do these guys get? I didn't see, but it's a lot. Oh, I see. So this can be a little frustrating. You gotta... <laughs> oh, my God. You gotta not bounce. Oh, my God. Yeah. Like, you gotta move back on the platform a bit and then jump forward, but you need forward momentum. Yeah, you need forward momentum, but you... Oh my gosh. I'm going to be here for days. Okay, go. I shouldn't have done this. This was a mistake. I'm coming, my friend! Kunio! I wish I was better at jumping, Kunio! <laughs> Get away from my friend Cootie! <laughs> yeah, keep backing away, buddy. No, no! Damn it! Alright, I shouldn't have gone on ahead. You shouldn't have. I did that to myself. Do not stay and fight the boss. Run, flee. <laughs> I don't even see him. He must. He doesn't. He'll appear if you go towards that door. Let's make our way back. We'll make some money. You can just drop down. Like, oh, you'll oh. be okay. Alright, back to 800. Yeah, you get some money for a while. Oh, okay. these guys are actually only dropping 90. Oh. No, I mean 90s. 90s better than what we're it's getting from It's better than what we were getting map. from our uh, first tier school enemies. You gotta mind yourself too, we gotta get you back to the mall. Nice. Buff, buff, 
Double buff. Ah, now we're, now we're cooking with gasoline. Oh, God. Yeah. I gotta get back to the mall. Yeah. Hold on. I just, I feel real, real bad about this. Run! Oh, come on! Run! Yep, yeah, run. I'm coming. Move two forward and throw the brass knuckles. Alright. Alright, here we go. Whew. I don't think we went to this one. The convenience store. Oh, I have a burger! I could have eaten my burger. It's Vitamins, energy, recharge, turtle power! Nice. Yeah. That is a... Uh... At this time in history, every young man wanted to have the power of a turtle. Quick question, though. When did this game come out? Uh... What was the release date of this I mean, game? it's certainly later than the existence of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. For sure? The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles were only invented in the... Uh... I'm almost positive. Mid to oh, late... Oops. Uh, what should I buy? I'm up, I don't know, but okay, I'll find it. Let's see. Downtown Niketsu Story. Originally released 1989. 89, okay. April yeah. 1989. No, no. So, yes. With, with that's, absolute certainty, we can say. That's well after the Turtles were out. In fact, I believe that's right after the first Ninja Turtles game, so that is probably specifically what they are referencing. Uh, I'm gonna buy a thousand dollars worth of recharge. Okay. Yes, please. Uh, oh, no. I gotta, I gotta eat it manually. Hold on. Yep. Oh, yeah. We, we, just like when you go to the actual pharmacy, they don't make you take all the pills you're buying right there before you leave the store. 56. Alright, there we go. Also, I will say that some... Uh, pharmacy drugs are required to be taken in the presence of a pharmacist. Oh, uh, <laughs> makes sense. I guess you, uh, obviously you would know. You run a pharmacy. Mm -hmm. Just, just for clarity's sake, I don't yeah. want to be spreading false information no. on this, on this educational stream. No, how can we, how can we comment on games that uh, portray, you know, gritty urban life? Mm-hmm. Well, not even knowing what goes on in our own city's pharmacies. Mm -hmm. I do love the mock kick. It really is helping quite a bit. Yeah, it's simple but satisfying. Let's get you that book. It's a real natural uh, first level move improvement. Yeah, get a coin. How much? These eh, guys, 60. 60. I do love sometimes that you just do one solid punch. I can't tell if this guy has beady eyes or glasses. There's definitely a guy that has glasses, but I'm just not sure if uh, this hold guy on. has. This guy? No, that guy has definitely just got beady eyes. That guy's not wearing glasses. There's one guy who is very clearly wearing big, thick glasses. Yep, there's, there's definitely a dude in Coke bottle glasses. Alright, going out this way? Yeah. Oh, God. No! Oh, damn it. Come back, come back, get out of here. I don't want to fight the tough guys when I just got drilled coming into the screen and I'm almost dead. Huh, what up? Ah, weaklings. They're not that weak. They're giving us cash. Hmm? They're giving cash. How much are they giving? Okay. okay. 50. These are the these are the level one guys. They're weak. Let's let me put it this way. They're weaker than those other Gracie guys for sure. Yep. But, but they're stronger than a lot of the first level dudes. No, these are the these are the lowest level first level dudes. Are they really? Yes. Ah. Just at this at, in this area we can meet like tier one and tier two schools. Ah, okay. I enjoy the uh, tier system of schools. <laughs> yeah. Are they ranked, like, in-universe by... <laughs> yes, yeah, the, the school board ranks schools based on how tough their delinquents are. Oop, it's how you... Uh, we're real class. It's we're how they class determine, the yeah, uh, funding levels for dodgeball teams mm -hmm. are determined by the toughness of your school's delinquents. Yeah, you got a point? 
One more. One more, one more. Ah, cleverly dodging it by just not actually being in the path when I threw it. There what? we go. Let's okay. get that book. All right. What you gonna get? I'll get Ma. Oh, we gotta. We're not even at the right mall. We gotta. No, we gotta. We gotta hustle back. Cross town. Okay. I gotta stay alive. All right, we're gonna ignore this boss here. Yes, we're definitely ignoring the boss. Ooh, I'm exhausted. Hold on a sec. Haha! <laughs> Action shot. I'm gonna eat my tech burger. You know what? Not about it. Hey! Tech burger makes you better at hitting people with weapons. I'll use my salmon. Just a little stamina, and that's it. Alright. Salmon roll, nothing much. Take out salmon maki. Ha! <laughs> Great a oh jeez. <laughs> Great action shot. Great action shot. I'm nailing him with the brass knucks. Alright. Let's go. Press the start button to resume. There we go. And we're good. This guy in his defense. Haha! -ha. There's yeah. your defense now. And Numuaka. A level three school. I'm not confident that I'll start retaining the school names and like associating them with, with their things, but you never know. Oh, we should have this screen up just in case we uh, get in peril and yeah. lose half that money. Yeah, the big ticket purchases are high pressure. That's why I think we can we can accept going forth without the screw attack. But we'll definitely want to get more uh, good techniques as we okay, of move course. forward. So there will be this uh, this cycle. And just uh, we haven't commented on it, but absolutely gorgeous backgrounds. Like oh yeah, everything in this sure. game is just uh, the the artists at Technos just had complete mastery of the NES, which is funny since their first work on NES they were so unfamiliar. Just for variety, I'll do mock punch. Uh, they were so unfamiliar with the hardware that to get it going, get Double Dragon going, they went down to single player and never, pardon me, never had two different enemies on screen at once, etc, etc. But man, they really do have a mastery on it. Oh yeah, read that book! And then, just not that long later, I've learned the skill Mach Punch! Alright. Don't get punched really hard in the face. Oh, that's, boom, boom. that's very good. Oh yeah, give yourself tennis elbow real quick throwing these box punches. Jeez. Boom, boom, boom. It's very satisfying. It's super satisfying. Come on. There we go. How are you doing for funds? Like, you have a lot? Yeah. You should consume something? I don't have anything in my pockets. Alright. Let's I'm gonna buy some Ready food. Get you sushi. Some food? Well, let's go back to that park. Yeah. And see I don't think anything there are times when like going back to a place, like eventually we'll have an there'll be a boss there and you gotta beat them to yeah. advance. I'm not sure that that's happened, but it's worth checking. Hey, okay, this is you. Yeah. What do I want? Uh I mean, you know, I might as well. Can I afford any quality sushi? You can afford some Codro. Codro. I'm gonna get some urchin. Give it to me. I'll tell you that. See what it's like. Nice. Right. Punch one. Energy two. Stamina third one. It's good to get your punch up now yeah. that you've got mock punch. Yeah, now that I am speed punching dudes, the harder the better. Get me some quality sushi. Urchin. I would like some urchin, my good man. Power 2, energy 2, stamina 64, max stamina is maxed out. Here we go. Okay, yeah, Urchin is restorative. It is. Okay. And did it boost other stats? What did it do for you? My power. Alright, you suck at Juku chumps. Power is, I believe, exactly what it sounds like. Just like a general damage of it. Stop that. Come closer, jeez. Alright. So we can't go into the water faucets. 
No. So James, how aware are you of the uh, Japanese school system? Uh, not super. Why? Do you have I something to I don't know, you to want to learn some interesting facts about the Japanese school system? Sure, hit me. So Japanese, uh, Japanese teenagers are actually only required to go to school until, uh, high school. Yeah. Although most, uh, about 95%, uh, choose to go to high school. They have an incredibly high high school enrollment rate. Oh, you mean, rate. they're not required to go to high school. No. Uh, nice. That was sweet. Um, so, uh, about 95% too, the only ones that don't really are sort of, uh... Okay, yeah, nothing here yet. Or possibly ever. Like, this might just be a side part, but I feel like at some point we'll, uh, we'll definitely be backtracking to, uh, at least one side place that will suddenly have a fight. So, um, anyway... Yeah, only about, uh, of the 5%, most of those are rural students who will, uh, who are planning on inheriting farms. Yeah. Uh, but to get into high school, you have to apply and enroll in, in all high schools. Okay. So, uh, there's tons of high schools that are, like, public high schools that pretty much accept everybody. Yeah. It, it's very hard not to get in. Uh... But there's also specialty schools, some of which are just, like, better schools overall, and some of which are incredibly finely home- Oh, focus! Oh, uh, dear. I forgot! I forgot which map we were going on to. Oh. That's how you punch, dude. That's how you punch. Dude, Ryan, I hit me once. What you gotta do is hit a dude three times, man. Anyway. Oh no, I'm stuck holding this box. Wow. So in a lot of in a lot of manga and anime, you'll see somebody who's like, I'm going to be the best soccer player in the world. Yeah. And because of that, I've gone to Soccer Academy. Yeah. And then if you actually look it up, Soccer Academy is like a real place. And there's like <laughs> eight of them. Back on your feet, quick. What? 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 It's too strong. Sniff, sniff. Alright. I assume he's not smelling our strength. No, he's crying. He's crying. So we've beaten him so set, so uh, aggressively. So anyway, yeah. I mean, Kunio might go to delinquent high school, where the only thing is uh, being he, a delinquent. I mean, he goes to Burning Blood High School. Yes. Where being fucking fired up is, is just the school motto. Although, given that, at, at the very least, his his nerd buddy, whose name is escaping me, who's defend, whose honor he defended in Rampage, also goes to the school. In Renegade, I mean. What I'm saying is, Kunio might be a... Uh... He, he might be a delinquent, but the fact that he even regularly attends school is a sign that he is... He, oh, it, he's, it belays his, his good heart. He's not that, like, I mean, he's the captain of the dodgeball team. He's, he's a jock. Yeah. <laughs> he's just play. he's even playing the tough guy sport. The tough dodgeball? <laughs> yeah, in, in this world, dodgeball is the tough guy. You, it's, it, this is not your, like... When I was in high school, we played dodgeball. It was an elimination game, not a literal uh, uh, last man standing <laughs> game where you Whoa. hit each other as hard as you could with what I assume is heavier than a volleyball until you were literally beaten unconscious. Yeah, their version of dodgeball definitely combines aspects of a battle royale situation. Well, but the, it's very—it is a very formalized thing too. It is, yeah. I never played. I played a lot of dodgeball as a kid, as I'm sure many people did. Uh, classic gym game. I can't ever remember playing like a structured three on three, a six on six, but you have three offensive players who aren't like valid targets who surround the other team's like side. Well, we had that. Which is a great. When you system. got eliminated, you went to the outside and you could get yeah. back in by eliminating somebody who was actively in the game. These, these, uh... Oh no! How did this happen? We weren't looking. 
Do you want to head back to the mall? Oh, absolutely. I've got a good yeah, chunk of got, money. You've got a great chunk of money. Let's get back at the mall. I'm gone. Go, 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 go. Hi. Cool. <sighs> We've been real drag right. to get taken down on the ricochet there. Okay. Uh, sushi. So what do we got? Yeah, sushi's the way to go. Even though this is like cheap diner sushi. No. Look uh, at that. You can get liver. You know what? Curry. Give, give me your finest curry, I guess. Delicious. You curry. All right. Kick. Wow. Kick boosted. Well. Stamina forty. for you. Stamina's good though. Uh, I'm and getting, I mean, I'm... we got to experiment here. One cutlet. Stamina boost, and that's it. Right. So Curry's kick. I'm getting some curry. And stamina. Now, James, I will say we're getting to our cutoff time here pretty soon. Mm -hmm. I do not know where to end this. <laughs> Unlike a lot, it is kind of like it is a it is a cycle. So like, what do we? Oh, we'll what's, just. What's our cutoff point here? Let's just keep going, and we'll save. We'll, uh, the cutoff is the time because we're obviously gonna play this game. Yeah. Like. We gotta finish the game. We gotta see it we through. Gotta we gotta through, beat yeah. the Dragon Bros. So I think we just we carry on. Now, are the Dragon Bros, as they sound, a direct reference to Double Dragon? Uh, yeah. I don't believe that they are. Like, they're clearly not the Double Dragons. Uh, well, they could. I mean, if they were just like color coded, we could get pretty close with it. Uh, you know what? What game the Double Dragons do appear in? That's not a Double Dragon game. Do you? No, I do not. Super Spike V-Ball, the beach volleyball game. All right. They're they are one. Billy and Jimmy are one of the teams. And they're just legit the Devil Dragons. Can they? Do well, the, it's like uh, you know, it's not post-apocalyptic volleyball, kick? so like, you know, but it is them, and it's, it's a techno. It's an alternate universe. It's a techno's game. This is what they would be getting up to if they. They wanted. look like the Double Drag. They are the Double Dragons. They are the Double Dragons. That is, I played so much of that game when I was a kid. It's such a great game. It has a great soundtrack. Extremely fun volleyball gameplay. It's weird in a, like in hindsight, it's weird that it's not a, uh, that it's not the Ketsu volleyball. <laughs> but, uh, cause it has like, it has super spikes that are very, very similar to your, to your super dodgeball hits. Your super throws in dodgeball. It's a it's a great little game, and the weird thing that I learned as an adult is that there's a full set of sprites for women's teams that they just they cut. Oh like, no! Obviously late in development. Okay, these guys give. One really sad happen. thing for me is that I've learned there is an a, a like that game is an excellent soundtrack. I mean. You're already familiar with the idea that Technos games have great soundtracks. Uh, it's got a great soundtrack, and it, it was uh, there was an album released of it, like of of live instrumental versions of all the songs. Okay. And I can only find like two of them on YouTube. Oh, really? Yeah. I might just have to search right. Whoa. Now. Whoa, yeah, guys. Take that, Kai. Two ten. Wow, we're gonna make money so these off of these guys. guys. Well, or we're gonna get beat down. Oh. Okay. Come on. What am I hitting? That time I just didn't land on it, so that's fine. Okay. okay, I am not going over there and getting the party started. I know. Let me just sign. This is the most annoying jumping. It's the. This is the. Uh, this is the equivalent of like. The surprise you're doing platform jumping over spikes on on conveyor belts in Double Dragon. Like, I don't think it gets any... There's no, like, high-stakes platforming. No. But... But every time I try to move back, I just come off. Every person who I've ever played this game with uh, goes through this lengthy struggle. You do it so flawlessly. I don't know that that was always true, but... I mean, I've... I've I've played a fair I just bit. wish you could affect your momentum mid-air, you yeah. know? Like, no, it would be so I... much easier. But I can't... Alright. 
Come on. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? What are we gonna do? Jump on my head. Thank God. I don't know. Now I've got the yips. Ah, uh, yeah, I can't do it anymore. We're stuck. No, I'm good. Okay. There. I can get now just idea. yeah, you can do this part. This is easy. It's that. It's that Mock little punch. jump. Nice. Very frustrating thing can happen at this part, and it has happened. Which is that the next enemies can spawn on the other side. Or did no one spawn? Are we I just done? Anyone spawn? No, nope, there they are. Because I was gonna say there was Hold a on. boss here, so I can do this bit too. It's just that it's it's that that first narrow step. box. Like, let me just I can fight these guys relatively low risk by dropping down with the mock punch. Oh, there's only one. Now you've done it, as you've just picked him up. Okay, have, here we yeah, go. Have I? Have I now? I'll let you join me. I don't want to fight this boss alone. So I don't know if this helps, but the key is, it's not actually, I don't know, take a step before you do the jump to get momentum. It's initiate your momentum literally at the instant of the jump. I'm gonna motorize ya! Oh. So you say, Nishimura. I don't know, Nishi. I don't know, pal. What? 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 Uh -oh. oh no! My oh. plan was to swoop in and save you, not to swoop in and avenge you. Oh, you're gonna swoop in and avenge me. Oh, what a hunk of change I lost. Oh, he's he's getting close. Kaboom! He got him. Oh! Somebody's what waiting in the park! Yeah, there we go. 300! Nice! Making money. Okay. All right. Let's call it there, James. Shall we retreat to the retreat, retreat to the mall, to the mall. spend our money, or spend my money? Spend, yeah. I'll spend mine. Well, Kutaka students. Oh, well, they'll give us money. I do like their great booyah. I like the the weird. <laughs> Placement of the explanation mark? Yeah. Booyah! I was so happy when they released this. It's so cool, that, like, because like I said, I played all of these games all the time on emulators, and eventually there were translation patches for all of them. Aww. But to actually have official translations uh, commercially available on, like, excellent emulators that have this quality up mode that maintains the feel of the game while... Getting it, like, rid of all the flashing? Yeah. And, like, I'm open to the, like, I understand there's some people who just want the authentic emulation experience, and it's not authentic to remove the flicker, uh, but at the same time, it's I didn't do less too sucky. Bad. I didn't do too bad regaining some money here. Nah. Especially, like, because our minds are still keyed to, like, the amount of money that you can feasibly... Oh no. Burn in the early going. Are we having fun yet? So she Yeah, I, I'm having a good time. I have fun. Kicking your ass and throwing you on the back of your head. Bye bye. Yeah. Okay. All right. well, so you want some sushi, my man. I need you some. You want to be meat. revitalized. Well, hold on. What else? What else is there? Uh, there's the bookstore, there's whatever. I think this is takeout. Yeah, this is All right, take rice. Out rice. Is pretty yeah. cheap. Except for the SP rice, which uh, you can't afford. And, I mean, I gotta assume the gold rice is pretty good. But maybe it's just a thing where they trick you. Yeah. I'm good. The gold flex don't make the rice tastier or more nutritious. So why you, you paid for it. The human body can't digest gold. So if you ever eat anything with gold flakes in it, all you're doing is shitting gold. Well, that's pretty, uh, that's pretty tight. I don't know. Ah, you know what? The curry, the curry was no. The curry had punch built in too. No, the curry was kick. Right, kick. Yeah, it. Uh, it had liver? a thing that I didn't need as much. Great what about liver? Power. Power. Stamina forty. Good stamina boost. Yeah. Okay, and uh, 
<laughs> Give me some miso fish while I'm here. Yes, please. Eat the miso fish. Fence Vents three? plus three. Stamina, stamina 24. 24. Alright. It always says max stamina is maxed out. I'll try the gang punk, just because it's the only thing we haven't eaten from yet. Ginger pork, I assume that stands I'm for. Ass I'm assuming. Or yeah. perhaps it is just ging pork. Weapon. Stamina 8 to the least stamina. And it gets you some weapon. Uh, et. no. I'll I think it's because it. I've... All right. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, you know, let's take a Save. look here. Our stats. Uh, yeah, let's look at our stats. Yeah, hold on. Did they hack a save game feature in through the emulator? We'll do the save state just to double up on it to be sure. Oh, wow, yeah, your max stamina is way higher than mine. Mm -hmm. uh, my defense. I really worked on that defense. You did, yeah. But you're even a better puncher than me. I have done very little to help my offensive stats, so I should probably work on that. That'll be my project for next time. So what's the save? Yeah, save. Okay, so we're going to just here on the record. We both saw it happen. But if they've hacked in a working save feature? Save. Select a file. Game saved. File one. Okay. Uh, but then I think now you need to also go to the save menu and save your character. I think. There is uh, there is okay. no upper dan in this menu. Yeah, sorry. Okay. There. Wait. No. No, you've saved over me now. Yeah. Now you're in file one. So go back again. And I will go in. I, we have a save state. This doesn't matter. <laughs> but it's just Maybe. novel. They, I mean, they, this, was, this is serious work. Yeah. Because as you... Uh, probably realize from this menu this is a password game yes like that's what they would actually do to let you re get your characters back and indeed we would each get a password nice ah it would tell us the password here but also this is how we come back with, ah you know we don't need to do that okay no. cool so there you go yeah river city ransom this is a really fun game yeah this is i think the funnest game we've played so far I enjoyed the Double Dragons, I did, but this has more of a, this introduces an itch to scratch and allows you yes. to, to, to play that cycle. It's not just I progressing think, from one map to the next. I think of the original trilogy, Double Dragon 2 on Ness is the only one that, that can like hang mm. with Downtown Niketsu Story River City Ransom. Mm -hmm. But yes, it's a wonderful game. It's just really cool. Mm -hmm. uh, and it, you know, I think Technos had already demonstrated that if you just take away the ability to pump quarters in, a three life limit, and then the, so therefore the desire to get better at the first stage that you can beat easily, but you want to beat it easily without taking damage and without losing lives, and so on through levels, is a perfectly viable way to bring the arcade beat em up experience home and make it make sense on a console. Yeah. But this is a much more involved way to make the beat em up experience make sense on the console. It, it yeah, makes sense because this, this, this is designed what, for console. Exactly. Uh, the difference is, like you said, it's it's them trying to take the arcade experience to the home. This is trying to give you a console experience with the beat em up. Yeah. So like it def it it's got a whole different feel to it. It's it's in, it's creating a cycle which which arcade games kind of don't have. The cycle is you give us another quarter. Yeah. Who is this? They're trying to say this. They're trying to invent a cycle that will keep you playing it when your only limit is electricity and time. Yeah. So, yeah. And we're going to have a... Like, we're not going to spend a great deal of time on every Niketsu game, Kunio game on no, the NES because no, no. most of them are sports games. But even some of the sports games are relevant because they meet, like, uh, like the, the last one on NES, Gambar Dunk Heroes... Mm -hmm. uh, I think Gambar just means all out or something. But uh, Gambar means like let's go. Or yeah. Like, good job. Two on two basketball, but it maintains full beat em up controls with with basketball controls also added in. So like you got the punching and kicking and fighting is a big part of like ball control. Oh yeah. Anyway, 
So we'll uh, we got a we got a lot ahead of us. Yeah. Uh, with this delightful art style, uh, and before it's time to step back and start looking at the other beat 'em up. You know the the eventual entry of of licensed characters into the beat 'em ups through Ninja Turtles and The Simpsons. That's so cool. That's, oh, The Simpsons beat 'em up. I played a lot of from the rental store. That and the Simpsons racing game. That was the uh, first, uh, that was my first real uh, taste of the Simpsons. I wasn't allowed to watch the Simpsons when I was that young, but just seeing them in the arcade and be like, okay, I I get the idea. I get it. Yeah. They beat a lot of people up. Yeah. You know, I put a lot, I tried to put a lot together of what the Simpsons were from uh, that Simpsons arcade game and Bart versus the world, Bart versus Mm. the space mutants on NES. Mm. And... Uh, Disco Stew and the man in the bee costume seem to be important characters. Yeah. And, like, not, <laughs> not allowed to watch The Simpsons, but we did have Columbia hosts. Remember getting, like, eight CDs yeah. a month? So we had The Simpsons Sing the Blues. Uh, we had that on, on cassette and then later on CD for some reason. And it was just, like, from all of that, trying to compute what The Simpsons was, I was not in any way prepared for the, the, what, the, uh, the, the first time I... That because my, we were at my grandmother's, and my uncle Jimmy wanted to watch Simpsons, so uh, so they let me. And it, the first episode I ever saw was the one where Homer needs open heart surgery. Oh, okay. And I was not ready. I was not. <laughs> I just like I remember like that one has an emotional punch at the end. That one actually builds to yeah. Like... But even like to me, the the thing from that first watch of the Simpsons that really always stuck with me, and this is like probably like the. 15th to 20th probably not even that probably not even a top 25 best line in the episode but when dr nick's doing the surgery and he's like and uh, some things connected to the what uh, he's like saying th- but he's like first he's drifting away from medical terminology to the the something and the red things connected to my wristwatch what? and when he said that i was just like you know i was like nine years old or ten years old i was like oh my god <laughs> this is the height of the- anyway yeah far afield here from a downtown niketsu story but but not that far afield no. we got there through to tank to ne- connective tissue oh yeah yeah we are yeah so lots of uh, is connected to our wristwatch we got a ton of uh excellent beat-em-up experiences left to go before we have to deal with the stagnation of the genre in the sure. mid to late 90s. So that's But exciting. then it only takes till the t- the late 2010s early 2020s until we get to the rejuvenation of the genre. Well, the rejuvenation begins with like Castle Crashers and stuff. So that's, that's true, like mid 2000s. That's fair. That's fair. But we're really looking for gems during that period more than anything else. But and like uh, there will be like like for, for Guardian Heroes if we can get access to a good working version of that game because that was the saturn game i believe uh well james why don't you run us through uh the schedule for this week oh yeah so what else is coming up here tomorrow afternoon i will be diving in to chrono cross uh an ending an end game is taking form in the sense that they've told me you got to visit all the dragons if you're going to stop the uh uh you know lavos uh from continuing to do his thing and, uh, yeah, so that's that's Wednesday. Friday Night Forgotten Circles is not happening on Friday. Yeah. So uh, make some plans to go out, folks. Uh, <laughs> on the weekend, on Saturday, I'll be back playing Starflight, that seminal uh, space exploration RPG. Things are really picking up steam there. I'm learning more about the ancients, more about this uh, the, the solar flare problem that keeps destroying all life, moving outward from the core of the galaxy. And then on Sunday, we're firing up Quest for Glory 2, Trial by Fire. I'm going to port my, my mage, who just defeated uh, Hero's Quest, So You Want to Be a Hero. Later called Quest for Glory, So You Want to Be a Hero, when they neglected to trademark that faster than Milton Bradley, Bradley did theirs. And I'm really looking forward to that, to see because uh, it's not only is, like, aesthetically, I think... Uh, I'm more excited about Arabian Nights setting than, than Germanic fairy tale setting. But also, as a hero's journey, like Hero's Quest or Quest for Glory 1 does an excellent job of really making you feel like someone who's just a scrub who wants to become a hero. Yeah. And you develop to become a hero. So I'm excited so to show up out. somewhere yeah. being a hero and like find out I'm not powerful enough and have to develop more. 
but have something going on at the start. Uh, and then I just assume that, you know, they they had more time. They had done their experiment in fusing RPG mechanics into a point and click, or a, at that time, a, a text parser adventure game. And they had uh, also developed the experience with coming up with puzzles that can be solved sometimes in three different ways and that play fair with you. And I'm hoping that that enabled them to keep playing fair with the puzzles but make them a little more challenging. Because there aren't really many hard-to-solve puzzles in Heroes Quest, Quest for Glory. All right. But, yeah, so that's well, that's what's coming, folks. And next week we'll be back with more River City. And uh, until then, uh, thank you for joining us. Thank you for sticking around all the way to the end, if you did. Uh, it's been a quiet in the chat, so I don't know how many of you were there, but every one of you counts. And if there were none of you, well, you still count. You would have counted. You lived count. Uh, but thank you for joining us. You can uh, follow us down below. You can also subscribe if you can, please. It helps. And uh, we also have a Discord now, 58 Dream Street Invite on Discord. Link in the profile. Yeah. Come on by. And uh, until then, we'll back at you next week with more beat 'em up. And remember, the violence is never the answer, except in video games. Bye bye.